hello everyone welcome back to my channel so in today's video i'm sharing with you guys my saint patrick's day polish picks i really forgot that it was saint patrick's day this week but i wanted to share with you guys out of all my green nail polishes these are the nail polishes that i will pick out for a nice pretty mani so i have already gave them a swatch on my nails and if you're new to my channel welcome i hope you like what you see and if you do don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell too so you can catch all my videos that i upload for you so the first one i have is pure ice and it is called wild thing and it is a pretty cream polish and this is how it looks on the nail and I applied three coats the first coat was a little sheer it could it could have got by with two if your nails are shorter but I went on and applied three coats yes three coats of this very very pretty love this one it's like a lime green gorgeous and the second one I have is Kiss Gel, and it's a cream, and this is a two-coater. And by the way, it does stain. It stains really, really, really bad. So make sure you put on a base coat before applying this because it does stain. I have worn this before. And even with a base coat, my nails were still a little stained, but eventually, as you wear polish, it comes off, if that makes sense. And this one has no name, so, yeah, the Kiss Gel nail polish is not there. They have no names. Back in the day when I used to buy them or whatever, they used to all come, come with names. So, yeah, I lost all my polishes, so I'm starting off new. So, yes. And the Kiss Gel polish came from the Dollar Tree. You guys know if you're familiar with the Dollar Tree. And the Pure Ice came from the Dollar Tree as well, too. And the Pure Ice, the lime green one, the first one I showed you with the thumb, that is called Wild Thing. Wild Thing. And those, actually, when I brought the Pure Ice nail polishes, they came two in a pack. And this great formula those pure polishes pure ice nail polish it's a nice formula for cheap nice and they hold up very very well and the third one that I pick is LA colors and it is a mint it's called mint and this is what it looks like and this is another cream polish and I applied three coats of this one. It goes on like a jelly formula. It's really weird. It's very, it's not streaky. It just goes on very jellyish. Like it's very, it's a, it's a, like, it's like a thin, a thin coat. But then when you add on the second one, it's still a little thin. So I end up applying three coats to this one. And you can still see the smile line too in the one see right there after I applied the three coats and it dries it dries like a matte formula and this one came from the Dollar Tree and it's called mint and my fourth one is it's a sassy chic and it has no name but it has a number 925 and this is what it looks like. I love this one. It's a cream formula and it is gorgeous. That is beautiful to me. Love that. And this was two coats. Only two coats. Not bad. Great formula too, by the way. You can find Session Sheet, LA Colors, Kiss Gel, and Pure Ice. All those four, these four right here, they all came from the Dollar Tree. All of these. You really can't find pure ice anymore. I'm not sure why. 
but they need to make they need to bring bring in a new light collection they need to bring in their spring summer collection because their polish and the formula is great I'm telling you the kiss gel nail polishes again their formula is great as well too and LA colors and sass and chic sass and chic is getting to be real popular there now for polishes now and every now and then you you know you'll see uh um, Julia G or what's the other brand Drew Barrymore has her brand there too but yeah you can find different name brands you can even find um what's the other one um what is it I can't think of it now but it's a name brand too and it's a nice polish and their formulas are great too but let's get back on to my last green St. Patrick's Day color and that one is from China Glaze and it's called Free to be Sesame and you guys see me wear this before too and this was two coats look how pretty that is you got to have something shiny something shimmery in there isn't it gorgeous that is just so pretty to me see if you can see look at all that hollow in there is that gorgeous so pretty and this one believe it or not is a stainer too but like I said again just make sure you wear that base coat and eventually it will eventually come off and if you have problems with it use like a little lemon and if you guys want to see like my stain removers what I use for my nails sometimes um, leave a comment down in the bottom of the comment section and I will upload and show you how I get the stain off my nails. Even though they are, they're not as stained, but I've seen some nails are like, man, they're so stained, they look like they have like yellow polish on their nails. But anywho, yeah. But I hope you enjoyed my St. Patrick's Day polish nail picks. Let me know what you think down in the comment section. And I hope to get back with you guys. And happy St. Patrick's Day. I know it's late, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will catch you in my next one. Until then, take care. Bye.